welcome back to my channel. Thank you so, so much for watching. So today I have my monthly favorites for you guys and I'm really excited because this is the last video until we get into Vlogmas, which starts tomorrow. I'm excited, I really, really am. But I do have some favorites this month and it's kind of funny because I really don't have a lot of beauty favorites this month. I don't know what it was. It was kind of like I did my makeup but I kind of just did it the same way every time. It was like I didn't really branch out this month, we'll say, and I didn't really buy a lot of new products. But I do have some that I kind of just rediscovered in my collection that I will share with you guys. And then the rest is mostly like home products or just kind of like fun products. And also, it was my birthday this month, so that's definitely a favorite, and I don't want to forget to say it, but let's start off with that all-time favorite of the month. I just can't show it to you because I'm using it. And it is the camera. My parents and Nate went in and got me the Canon T5i camera and I love it. I really haven't used it that much yet. But Nate and I filmed that cooking show we did that you guys seem to like a lot with the camera and I felt like the quality was great. And we did a mukbang with it. I have filmed a couple sit down types but this is only like the second or third time. Yeah, I love it. I really, really do. And I will link it below where you can like look into it if you are looking for a camera. I definitely recommend it because since I just can't like show it to you because you're, yeah. Anyway, but let's get into it and I will start with beauty. But like I said, I don't have a ton. So first I am, and I've talked about this so many times that I will not spend a lot of time on it, but I have to show it because it is what it is, and that is the Naked Basics palette. I'm wearing it today, I've worn it all month, I've worn it all year. Like, I just love this little palette. To me, it has everything you need. It really, really does. This is my all-time favorite shade to highlight under the brow. I feel like it's a perfect shimmer white, but not like that stark white. And I feel like these are perfect just to set your primer on your lids and then just to give a little dimension. It's like the perfect palette. It really, really is. I love it. You've heard me say that a million times. <laughs> Next item is the Morphe G22 brush. This is an interesting one because it's really not a brush that I typically grabbed for before, just months ago. It wasn't like, oh, I have to have this in my collection necessarily. However, now I am loving this for my contour and for blush. I use it, I use it for both. I just love that it gives such like a subtle look versus like that true harsh contour, which has, it has its moments where you need that, but like, I don't know, I just, all month, I have been totally using this like stippling brush, this like foundation brush, to do those two steps. I love it. You guys know I love the Brow Envy palette from Too Faced, right here. It's like my favorite for brows. Well, I re-fell in love with the Brow Wiz from Anastasia. I just, this month, have been playing with my brows a little bit differently. Been loving to use this to kind of bring them in a little bit more and to find them a bit more than just a powder can do for you. And you just kind of can't go wrong with a Brow Wiz. Mm -hmm. Next two items are gonna be lip products, and you have seen me talk about this one in particular. This is by Bite Beauty. This is in the color Gelato, and this is just, oh, oh, I love it. I just love it. It is such a beautiful mauve nude. It really, really is. And it's just a lipstick, though. It's not a liquid lipstick. And then the Anastasia Beverly Hills Liquid Lip in Craft. I wore this on our uh, cooking show and the mukbang. Oh my god. It's just such a gorgeous deep color. I love it. I thought the color I'm wearing today is actually the Melted Berry color from Too Faced and I thought that these were going to be very similar and actually the one that I'm wearing today is a lot more pink. It's pretty but I was thinking it was going to be more of a berry like that deep berry color. I don't know. I like this one a little bit more personally. I think this is gorgeous and I love the formula on it. Okay, let's move on. So, this month, since I've been on the Starbucks kick again, it happens. It's like when winter and fall comes, it just happens. It just does. I told my dad, I was like, I really want one of their Christmas cups. So I got one. 
Yeah, I picked the one with the Christmas trees and I love it. And I've been having this for my morning coffee every morning as well as my tea throughout the day. Like I am using this like all day long now. Like what's your favorite holiday cup? That's what I wanna know in the comments. Cause you know how they came out this year with like eight different kinds? I picked the Christmas tree, but I mean, I like them all. I really do. But yeah, and then just so you guys know, cause I didn't know. <laughs> so it comes with like the black lid on top. And then right here is where you can get the, you know, drink out. But it swivels, guys. I don't know if you're going to see that, but it swivels to actually open and close. Yeah, that took me a long time to figure out. But I love that. They're $20, but, you know, it's like that ceramic really, like, keeps the heat. But also, you don't need anything because it won't, like, it's not too hot on your hands. It's I love it. I do. Next items are actually a birthday gift from my best friend, and I think it was so sweet because... And she knows I'm vegan and trying to just, you know, branch out a little more even beyond food of just organic or uh, plant-based uh, products aside from food and cruelty-free. So she got me the Mrs. Myers hand soap, which smells, guys, guys, this smells amazing. It is the peppermint scent that they brought, I think, for the holidays. And she got me the dish soap and the cleaner. I just did this on my counters and my table. Oh, the smell. Like, this makes you want to clean because it smells so good. There is no chemical smell to it at all, and it works really well. I will say I have not used the dish soap yet, only because I have some still that I'm getting through, but I have smelled it because it smells amazing. I was wondering, though. Oh, well, you guys know I love peppermint, eucalyptus, any of that. I'm, I'm all in. So this was totally me. But I was wondering, I wonder if I could use this dish soap instead of on dishes, but actually on my brushes. I'm going to try it. I am. I, mm, I love. And then I got the hand soap again. So I would definitely recommend these products. They smell so good. Completely natural. Completely cruelty free. Mrs. Meyers brand is. I know you can find it at Target. I've seen it. But I'm sure it's at other places too. But I'll link it below. Love. The smell is amazing. The last item I want to show. This may be a bit outdated in that it's probably looks a little bit different now than when we first got these because we've had these a few years but I want to include this because this has been a lifesaver for me especially I know going into this next month with vlogmas I vlog on my phone and it works very well for me because guys we always have our phones on us right like we always do so it just works great however when you do video it just kills your battery it really really does now they make like cases now that like charge your case and then when you need your phones like dying you can like turn on your case and that charges kind of cool but it is kind of like bigger cases on it and stuff which kind of like eh, can get kind of annoying probably Nate and I both have one of these. We have two of them, and this is the Mophie charger. And basically what it is, is it's like this battery pack that you charge in the wall like normal, and it has two USB ports to plug in whatever products you really want, actually. Um, and then the middle one is to charge it. But we love this thing. It charges my battery basically four times on my cell phone four times without needing to be recharged here. So I will f link this below for you guys. My only thing is, is I, like I said, we've had this for a few years and I don't know if maybe like the model has changed because this is a little big, it's a little heavy because I like to throw this in my purse when I go places. I just kind of always have it with me. I like to have it in bed when I'm really lazy and my phone's almost dead and I want to play on it still and I don't like that it doesn't fit my normal charger comfortably for me to lay in bed. It's true. <laughs> I love this thing. I really, really do. They work amazing and they work on multiple products. It's meant, I think, more so for your phone, but you can do an iPad. I mean, whatever you, it's a battery pack, you know? So I'll find this for you guys or the updated version of it because I think you guys would love this if you're someone who's like always running out of battery. It happens. Mm -hmm. That's going to do it this month, guys. I really hope you enjoyed this. I'm just so excited to go into Vlogmas now. It's time. I am so excited that you're excited about it. And hopefully I can keep them fun because my life isn't always fun. But that's part of the point, right? Like, it's just 
getting to hang out together and that's what's really cool. Anyway guys, thank you so so much for watching as always. Please give this video a thumbs up if you have not already and please subscribe if you have not already and let's get ready for Vlogmas. So excited and I will see you guys tomorrow.